Scientists from the Netherlands Observatory, led by astronomer Martin Oy, with a length of 16.3 million light years. To be honest, I thought there would be no more galaxy than the supergiant elliptical LC1101. Scientists say that the monster galaxy is usually too suspicious. But is it so, and why? And how will this discovery affect the views of scientists about the real structure of the universe? What is Alcyonesus? The open galaxy is located 3 billion light years from Earth and is located at a distance of 16.3 million light years. She was named Alcyonesus in honor of the same giant from ancient Greek mythology. This is the mightiest of giants, born by the sky goddess Gaia from the drops of the blood of the sky god Uranus and in battle, never left the western part of the Chalcedon Peninsula of Greece where he was born, because it was there that he was immortal. The giant radio galaxy Alcyonesus is 166 times larger than ours, and the diameter of the Milky Way is 30 kiloparsecs. One astronomical unit is equal to 149 600 million kilometers, which is 206,265 astronomical units. The mystery facing scientists is what is the catalyst for the emergence of giant radio galaxies. What do radio galaxies include? They include a host galaxy that countless stars orbiting a core with a supermassive black hole, plasma jets bursting out of the galaxy's center. Jets or lobes act as a synchroton to accelerate electrons producing radio transmission. The whole process transforms such galaxies into the source of the most powerful radio emission. According to scientists, the source of the jets is a black hole, since jets from it can travel long distances, turning into jets. But why do jets become giants in some galaxies and continue to grow on an amazing scale while others don't? The key to unraveling the appearance of such majestic and large-scale galaxies can be a detailed study of Alcyonesus. The second assumption of scientists is that the galaxy is located in a region of outer space where the density is much lower and this may have an impact on its expansion. The other hypothesis of the researchers admits that the interaction with the cosmic web could lead to such large-scale and incredible dimensions. According to modern models of the universe and the results of numerous studies, threads of dark matter connect huge galaxies and their clusters into a huge cosmic network. It is along these filaments that free hydrogen flows, thereby saturating galaxies. But it is not easy to see such flows as matter. Even with the help of the most sensitive instruments, it is difficult to detect the radiation of diffuse hydrogen in intergalactic space, a great many brightly glowing stars and galaxies. However, as the result of many years of work, an international team of astronomers visualized several fibers of the cosmic network of the early universe about 12 billion light years away from us. But even these insignificant by cosmic standards, threads are amazing. Alcyonesus is a fairly ordinary elliptical galaxy embedded in the thread of the cosmic web. Its mass is about 240 billion times that of the sun and the mass of the black hole at its center is 400 million times that of the sun. The monster galaxy was discovered by astronomers using a low-frequency array, LOFR. LOFR was conceived as a pioneering attempt to achieve a breakthrough in sensitivity for astronomical observations at radio frequencies below 255 MHz. Astronomical radio interferometers usually consist of an array of a parabolic dish. The device consists of a huge array of omnidirectional antennas using a new concept in which signals from individual antenna are not combined in real time as in most antenna arrays. Then the signals are digitized, transmitting to a central digital processor and combined in software to simulate a conventional antenna. To conduct radio surveys of the sky with adequate resolution, the antennas are assembled into groups that are scattered into an area of more than 1,000 kilometers in diameter. Currently, LOFAR receives data from 96 digital receiving units. We are there on the threshold of a new era of discoveries, 
not only in determining the true nature of the evolution of the galaxies, but also in absolutely all directions, thanks to the discovery by astronomers of the galaxy Alcinesus and its mysterious ongoing expansion. But how did a powerful galaxy structure magically appear from a completely unremarkable galaxy? So far, this remains a mystery and the ground for new research by scientists. Understanding the world around us is what is responsible for our progress. Once upon a time, thanks to Philip Rice, the possibility of transmitting sound over distances was created, which in 1876 was developed by Alexander Graham Bell and invented the world's first telephone, which became a real sensation. Now people can't live without a phone. So who knows what our understanding of the formation of the galaxies will lead to. Thanks to scientists, astronomers, researchers, and engineers, a great many amazing discoveries are waiting for us, which What Is will definitely tell you about. What would you like to learn from the world of science and space? Write to us in the comments. Your like and subscribe will be the best reward after any research that I have tried very hard to do. If you want to be aware of the most amazing events, subscribe to my Telegram channel and Instagram using the link in the description. Together, we will create the strongest community of science fans.